and I'm doing it for my daughter. So the migrant thing in a uh, mass, I got. A, I was at the uh, just now. I was at the uh, the illegal seafoods, right? Mm-hmm. I was like this. I just got a phone call from my buddy. This guy was like shooting at this guy. Yeah. He's like, I just got a phone call. My buddy runs the airport. He's like, I guess the migrants fly in. They have nowhere to go. Oh, we're getting Palestinians. They're setting up tents inside. The- TF Green Airport mm. right now. Mm. Oh, wow. They're going to all the public places, just setting up tents. Do you like the next phase of oh. our life? Mm. I was like, oh, cool. What country? Um, You know, Jap- Japanese. The best <laughs> ones. <laughs> the Japanese migrants. A bunch of guys are like sharpening their katanas. It's, they're mm. doing the Irish migrants again. They're bringing the Irish back in. Yeah. A bunch mm. of Conor McGregor guys. <laughs> the shadow boxing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I mean, they're doing it with hotels. I mean, it's like Dr. Zhivago. They they put them in hotels, and then when they get ballsy enough, they put them in your house. Hmm. Like, that's that's next after hotels and tents. Sooner or later, if you have a big house, they'll put them in your house. Mm. Isn't that nice? I can't wait. I love a roomie. Hey, it's, roomie. It's happened before. I just yeah. seeing them nonstop. It, this is not unprecedented. What happens when I them nonstop? I, I don't think is illegal in the I'm future. gay now. <laughs> no, th- there's no such thing as assault in the future. There I'm going to fuck them. Ah, oh, dude, I love fucking. You're just expressing yourself. They do, they're setting up tents at TF Green? Yeah. Mm. Like a tent inside TF Green? And TF Green like, or Logan? No, no, TF Green in Warwick. Mm. Really? Yeah. That's really beautiful. We shouldn't have voted, I guess, or something. I thought that was interesting. Well, damn, I better go check it out. Let's go check it out. We should go on a flight right now to Ireland. We can go to Iceland. <laughs> Yeah. It's like six hours away. That'd be majestic. Yeah. Have you guys seen anything uh, in public that's pissed you off uh, lately? Yep. I have. What happened? A busker at get, Dave, on the, get on the mic, Chris. A, bus, a busker at Dave's Marketplace in Cranston near Garden the, on Pontiac. No. With, a, with a, an electric accordion that can be heard uh, like a mile away. Really? Mm-hmm. This is a bum? And, and, yeah, a bum. And uh, they're not even homeless. They're like, I need, we need help with rent. It's at yeah. Dave's, and I think I think they got I think D- Dave's management got t- took. They care paid of that. some guy to kill him. T- t- took care of that real quick because I wa- I was I was like disgusted. I'm like, oh no! They saw your face. I thought it was kill sa- this guy. I thought I was safe here. I was like the area I live in. I was like, oh my god! No, we simply do not have the infrastructure to keep you safe. We simply do not have it. We yeah. have everything else, but accept that. Yeah, <laughs> that's that weird. That pissed me off. So we can go to space, but we can't do that. It's beyond our technology. <laughs> oh really? Okay. And then San Francisco. You know, everyone's completely cleared out overnight. Yeah. Mm. Didn't that did that happen in San Francisco yeah, or yeah. wherever it did? San Francisco. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You're like this. Oh wow! It looks like they do have that technology. <laughs> <laughs> it just snow plows. <laughs> they just like drop the plows like it's like New England guys with Chevy 2500s just dropping a fisher of eight foot of snowball <laughs> just plowing them like snow sooner or later that's sick sick that's yeah a busker I, I hate that what's a busker like what is that a word yeah what, what, what does it mean a busker means like a multiple instrument player right a busker is somebody that p- performs on the street for money oh okay wow. I thought it was uh, someone who plays like five things at once <laughs> You know, like dee, 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 right, yeah, right. the drum thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like your knees have symbols on them. It's a sick thing. You should have. You should have said like, "I'll give you a hundred dollars if you let me try your accordion on." <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Throw it across the road. <laughs> oh wow! You yeah. pick on him like a high school kid. Yeah. <laughs> you just straight up high school bullying bums, buskers. You're like, yo, I'll t- I'll give you I'll give you five hundred bucks if I get a picture with your accordion. You throw it across like a bully. Yeah. Went went to this Japanese place in in Providence. I mean, we we're cr- crossing the street. There's a guy with like. Like a like a chicken, like a like a dead chicken cleaned and everything, like holding a chicken, like walking erratically, like like it's. Well, I mean, I know this is like not new news, yeah. but in Providence, that sort of thing, you know, in what, like doing that, the shit areas. street food. No, no, I mean like a oh. like a crazy guy that's like freaking oh. out on something, like oh, yeah. that. If he's next to you, you have to be ready for him to like do something. Right. Like I'm like this. Wow, this is safe. Yeah. Too bad we don't. We lost that technology after the flood. The, the technology <laughs> of safety of the citizens <laughs> of the nation. Yeah. What we gained in space, we lost in safety. Oh, yeah. We gained so much in space. Look what happened because of space. Uh, the CD players, uh, <laughs> micro... Ch- I, don't, I, don't, I don't even know. Like, what... <coughs> petrified wood. What did we get? Road safety <laughs> and just knowing what the world's like. Yeah. yeah. Knowing that someone can actually kill you when you're not looking. Yeah. Like, it can... Like, people are when capable standing, of doing that. When you're standing still. Yeah. Not only in movies, but it actually can happen to you. Yeah. <laughs> And un- unlike movies, there's no like musical buildup no. or like threatening aura. It's just nope. street cam, straight video. There's like you do a die check against your like your like spider sense. Yeah, the spider sense mm. against your like uh, 
political correctness or something right. like checks against that and most people are like there's nothing that can happen to me <laughs> 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 just or like a shank yeah. just to yeah. steal like ten dollars worth of gum <laughs> 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 Ooh, this is good <laughs> and then what you, what do you you suit what do you do get justice when you're dead you, <laughs> you have your family fighting for justice yeah. they have no idea what happened yeah, it's pretty sad. More likely, you have your girlfriend disowning you and going to visit the uh, the grave, <laughs> visit the criminal. Oh, I mean, for forgiveness. I guess you could yeah. call that out. Is that a real thing? I'm guessing it is. Yeah, that's. Did good. you didn't know about that? Uh, well, the I mean, what? I figured it the would happen. The, the guy that got stabbed, <gasps> and his, his girlfriend, his girlfriend begged f um, for a lighter sentence for the uh, the guy that killed his killed her boyfriend. That's who, incredible. Not, yeah, there was a there was a guy going crazy in the streets. This at, like, kid right here. Look at this, Ryan Carson. Do you remember this? Oh, I know exactly. He said, like, <laughs> man, chill or chill. <laughs> yeah. He said chill a chill, few times man. and he got killed. Fucking silly Billy. That sucks. Oh, this is the, uh, the like, third uh, picture. Show hard lefty that got stabbed in show the street or something like that. Chill, man, chill. That's rough. See, that's a man who doesn't know that you can actually, if someone puts a knife into you that's like a, longer than an inch and a half, like it can kill you. Yeah. Someone can do it by accident. You don't know, but mm. you can die from anything. Oh, yeah. I mean, that sucks, but. This is the dude that they had like the CCTV of him, like he was like in a coat. Mm -hmm. It was like semi recent, like a month ago. Yeah, he decided so to the, make a video drone video of himself. The, the black ago. dude that stabbed him, his girlfriend wanted to suck. Yeah. No, she did. She dug him up and is, is deceased. Oh, he's not deceased. The black guy's still alive. The black guy's right yeah. here. You want to watch it? it? Yeah. Yeah. I That's love dark. USA crime. <laughs> Activist and poet. <laughs> Might have been the guy's girlfriend he was fighting with or something. It's probably some sort of domestic thing the guy was going crazy for. Mm. Or who knows? So that that girl right there. I would have there, ran. <laughs> he, I mean, he tried. He, he, yeah. well, he, 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 was like, he was like chill and then like pushed him. Like I would have just like, you gotta like clearly this guy's like mental. I would have fucking ran. You gotta run. Sprint. You gotta run. Especially if, uh, if, if somebody says I'm from the Bronx. Mm. Yeah. That's his name. <laughs> From the Bronx. Yeah. Whoa! Oh, running. Oh, that's my uh, bro. I hope name. he's not Canyon. <laughs> Anywho. Yeah, you're not going to outrun that guy. If someone comes at you like that, you got to just bust him in the face. Yeah, that's fast it. Fast immediately. I would use the girl as a shield first. I mean, he, sh he should have. <laughs> Can you look up, look up Ryan Carson's girlfriend? What a fucking piece of shit, though. Wow. What a cut. What a drop charges. I wonder if she got paid to do that little stunt. The girlfriend of Brooklyn activist... She ha she had trouble picking out the perpetrator from a lineup, so she purposely like didn't identify the guy that stabbed her uh, boyfriend. <clears throat> maybe she wanted. Maybe it was a hit. Maybe she wanted him dead. Wow, uh, she looks Latina. Oh, she is. Yeah, she is, yeah. Claudia Morales, a cab. Ah, uh, those Latinas are crazy. Well, wow, they got some spicy in them, huh? It's not that she's Latina. It's that she's a um. She's an ACAB. Uh, What's that? Is that lefty. like ACDC? What's all, ACAB? All cops are bastards. Oh. Oh. Uh, okay. Uh, this world's fucked, huh? I don't even know what that is, dude. All this stuff is like strange as fuck to me when you hear that. I mean, I know, I know what it is, but like when you hear it like that, mm -hmm. like you, like you, when you start to like identify the hallways of, of fucking senility. Yeah. And you're like, this is fucking bananas. Mm -hmm. I really like it. Mm -hmm. he, uh, From the Santander like, group. Have you seen um, Sunset, Selling Sunset? No. <laughs> What's that? It's a TV, it's a reality show about selling real estate in uh, Los Angeles. Oh. I think you'd really like it. But go to um, YouTube and type in uh, Selling Sunset Oppenheim Twins. The, guy, the guys that run the um, oh. thing. I saw something uh, on TikTok with them. Like they put something in that was $40,000 or something. Mm -hmm. Like how much was that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my God. But they're like four feet tall. No. And they're, tw and they're <laughs> twins. And, um. Wow. Oh, that's. Is this Halloween? What's really funny is. Look at that guy. Thinking that one of the twins is like way more charismatic and better, and the other one's ugly and quiet all the time. Really? They look, even, like, they look the exact same. Mm -hmm. But if you look at them long enough, Brett is like. Wheeling uh, ass. Uh, he, he's like a uh, a weird little freak like compared a, to his brother. No way. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Do you watch that show? I've watched. I've watched a little bit of it. Good yeah. for you. You're for delving into the best reality mm. channel of all time. Bravo. It's mm. the best. You, yeah. If you want real, I mean, I think reality TV should be. Um, 
I don't think it should be shrugged off as much it's, as it is. It's Just relaxing and fun. Season, it is. a trailer right here, full time. screen. And this is my twin brother, Brett. <laughs> Which one sucks? The Oppenheim group Brett sucks. The ugly one. one. Buying or selling in the Sunset Strip in the Hollywood Hills calls us. Behind those doors is all of the kick-ass women that make this brokerage what it is. They're like the most toxic right. bitches in the whole world. What do they yeah. suck the, the clients? What do yeah, they do? Yeah. I don't come with the property. To the brokerage. Really? Yeah. yeah. Watch out. For a badass crew to hang out with takes a special type. Welcome to the team, Chrishell. Thank you, guys. She can tell us she proves herself. It was super Man cool. of a special type. You have to prove that you're serious about your job like the rest of us. Christine is the one that Jason and Brett kind of warned me about. That'll be interesting to see how she gets along with everybody, a.k.a. me. The bitches are fighting. <laughs> I throw yeah. Over the fucking hill. <laughs> I step on the right in front of Yeah, I can tell how well this is going to go. It's frustrating that people are talking. I thought we could work together, but clearly we can't. <laughs> I think I'm going to be Oh my God, you were throwing me under the bus. Okay. So you could have owned up to it. Cheers to causing trouble. This looks How good. Don't it's Damn. good. Man. Damn. Damn. Wow. You'd like to Why am I not watching this stuff? Go to uh, Chris. Um, go to type in Chris Shell and G Flip. So Chriselle, the the realtor, the new realtor they hired in here, she's fucking Jason or Brett or someone they fuck. Yeah. And then he gets bored of her, but she sticks around and she stays working for him. Uh-huh. And she becomes a because she's old. She's too old. She's yeah. like in her thirties. Like, get I think. that dusty. Get that here. old. I need something new. Get that plastic bag away from Listen, me. Listen, I'm fucking four foot one. Yeah. My fucking is soaking wet. I want yep. something fresh. I need something yep. new. Yeah, new. I'm worth forty thousand dollars. Get yeah. that plastic bag the fuck away. From yeah, that me right fucking, now. Yeah, that fucking uh, Auburn State fucking sorority girl out of here. Right? Yeah, stinky fucking Febreze. And so she sti- but she sticks around, still working, and she gets um, she gets married to a non-binary woman named who goes by the name G Flip. No, who's a rapper. Is this the? Vi- is this it right here? Probably. Go ahead and click that one. I mean, this... I love it. G'day, Chriselle. Welcome to 60 Minutes Australia. G'day. Yo. G'day. How are you? <laughs> Great. Uh, You've got that down pat already. I'm really trying. <laughs> this interv- First question Have you ever been. <laughs> this interviewer's oh, forehead vein is beautiful. Amazing. I feel like. And hers is too. Well, you know, right. it, we're just so meant for each other, truly. What was it that first. Stood what? out to you about G Flip. What, what do you think that? about what? that, bro? She's from Harry Potter. Yo. Well, I mean, God, I will say, lesbians. when you see G perform on stage, it's just Is that a Corona? really truly what they were it's meant white to wine. do. It's white wine. It's so <laughs> obvious and it's so sexy. Um, but Ugh. it was sexy, even though, you know, I, I was thinking, you know, I was straight at the time, <laughs> to be honest with you. Um, but. Uh, after cast. getting to know G yeah, what, and really just knowing punch who they someone are, out or punched a window. Um, I realized, you know, they are sexy no matter for me personally, you know, what I thought before. And then our just souls connected on so many levels, and I just feel like can we find footage of G Flip talking? Does she rap? She's got a spinoff. The inter- interviewer doesn't believe her. 